Hi guys, my name is Shar and welcome back to my channel. Today, after months of being in lockdown here in Beijing, China, I'm finally able to go out of my apartment. Yay! I can go out of my apartment, but I was not just brave enough to really go out of my apartment. So today, I made a plan to just get out for a little bit and just go to the park with my dog and my boyfriend. So my dog is here. Ta -da! Say hi, Bailey. <laughs> Are you excited to go to the park? Are you excited to go to the park? Okay, so we're gonna go to the park, but we need to get a couple of things ready before we go. So let me just put on some pants and let's get ready. Okay, so I put on some pants and I'm ready to prepare to go out. So this is the bag that I'm gonna bring. Okay, so first I need my wallet just in case. Of course, inside my wallet I have my money and everything. Next, I need my ID that proves that I live in this compound. Yes, baby. Let me just prepare the things that we need to go out. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Somebody's excited. Next, I need to bring my passport with me at all times. Because, you know, I'm an expat here in China. Keys to the house. Baby snacks for when she gets hungry. It's like keys. Yes. Uh, my glasses because I can't see without them and of course mask Is that all? Oh one more thing Hand sanitizer <laughs> better be prepared Okay, so we're ready to go Billy Billy are you ready to go? Are you ready to go? Billy are you ready to go? You don't have your leash. Where's your leash? Baby girl, where's your leash? Find your leash. Go get your leash. <laughs> she has no idea what is a leash. We haven't learned that yet. Okay, so I'm gonna get your leash for you. Hold on. Let's go, baby. Okay, so I'm just gonna get water and then we're ready to meet my boyfriend. So this is the only water bottle available in my house right now. So I'm just gonna bring this. <laughs> okay, so we're ready to go. So see you out there. I'm just gonna tie my hair and wear my glasses and my mask and I'll see you out there. So much excited.
The reason why we decided to go to the park is because our dog Bailey just turned five months old and she can go out now. What better way to introduce the world to her than by going to the park? My Bailey, my dog, had been with me since the lockdown and we were just stuck inside my apartment getting to know each other and just waiting for everything to get better. So once we got the news that a lot of Chinese people are outside and just living their normal lives, we felt it was kind of safe enough for us to go out for at least an hour or so to breathe in fresh air. And upon arriving at the park, I can just see Bailey's eyes light up. Bailey, we're at the park! Bailey, we're at the park! Bailey, we're at the park! She was so curious about everything that moves and makes sounds, which is the total opposite of what I felt that day. I felt a little anxious upon seeing that many people at the park because some of them are not even wearing masks. But seeing Bailey happy, having fun, so curious and running around, it made me forget that I was feeling anxious. Really, <laughs> 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 And I just knew that I needed to let it go. I needed to let go of my anxiety because this day is about my dog and you guys. It's about showing you how China is right now and introducing the world to my baby. Because like I said, she has never been outside before. She doesn't know that there are a lot of people. She doesn't know what is dirt. She doesn't know what is grass. She has never seen these things. She has been inside of my apartment all this time. So I know that this is for her and also for you guys. There were people flying kites, camping, fishing, and just having fun. I tried to join in the fun by flying a kite. Well, I said I tried. <laughs> It 
it ended up in a disaster. I didn't know you were supposed to stop and hold on to the kite sting. Oh. <laughs> you should not release all the way. Which was devastating because it was my first time to fly a kite. I uh, yeah, don't release all the way. You said release, there is two release law. Ah. Like 30. So I can't fly a kite because I released the string all the way. Now our kite is there. I flew the kite, yay! <laughs> <laughs> so you release and you didn't hold anything? Yeah. Because you said just just release. I thought it's gonna hold. I'm sorry. Oh. Okay, we still have bubbles. Bubbles! After the failed attempt to fly the kite, we let Bailey guide us. We strolled around the park and just let her have the best time of her life. If Bailey could speak, I bet she would tell you how amazing it was to feel the warmth of the sun on her face for the first time. To get to know the feeling of stepping on the weird texture of the grass and dirt on her paws. To see the number of people running around and calling her little pig. And to be outside not thinking about if it's safe or not safe for her to breathe in the air or touch other people. She'll also tell you that she understands it is not safe to go out, well not for now, and she knows that she has a big part to play and just needs to stay at home for a little bit longer. And that she will wash her paws and take a bath after going home. But she is grateful that she was able to experience the world with her mom and dad. Our trip to the park as you can see there's a lot of people already at the park so it means that people nowadays are really really like brave enough to go out I am still not that brave because I'm not sure if it's safe enough to go out now because there's a lot of news that there is a second wave of coronavirus here in in China that's happening so I'm not sure if I should be out that often. So anyway, that's it. Um, I guess somebody's really, really tired and I'm really tired as well. Um, yeah, we went home pretty quick because it was pretty windy outside today and it kind of like rained a little bit. I think there's like a storm coming. I'm not sure because summer is coming in very quickly. So I don't know. See you all next time. Don't forget to wash your head after you take off your mask so after i take off my mask i'm gonna wash my hands so i better put down my camera first before i touch my, my mask again my name is sar i create esl lifestyle and expat guide videos here on youtube if you're into that content don't forget to click subscribe and hit that bell button see you again next time bye bye <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.